So welcome back to the channel guys, no visit to Filton would be complete without a little look at Rolls Royce and I'm going to start off by looking this statue they've got outside now for those that don't know Rolls Royce could be said to have been paramount in winning the battle against the Germans in the Second World War because of a guy called Mitchell who whilst on the cliff tops one day was studying the birds and he saw the way they saw and in his heart and in his head he said I need to make a plane similar and as you can see this is obviously a bird but the wingspan is definitely in the shape of the Spitfire so what would we have done without Rolls-Royce you know they've got a very very long history of all sorts of stuff that's quite interesting look keep driveway clear and uh, somebody from Poland I think PL Poland has decided to to partner but looking at the mud many people do so there we've got the back of Filton or Patchway police station whichever it is and I will be uh, hopping in there as soon as I finish here this is just a very brief quick look I mean again this is one massive massive business I mean this place itself is just huge and I don't know if you can see but it spreads right the way down to my left massive thousands and thousands and thousands so this is um, defense aerospace operations so we don't really want to be doing too much here obviously quite good security there's some lovely views for the office people um, so what I'm going to ask Justin lovely, here much, Bye. cheers hello mate I don't suppose you've got any historical information have you no and if you're filming you can't film on site I'm afraid I'm not on site at the moment no, you are I? on site you're on Rolls Royce's property right? do you know what I love it when I try and be polite and ask a simple question all I need was a simple answer yeah I, I can give you some information can you yes. that would be very nice of you thank yeah. you yeah but it is open isn't it yeah so it is public right of access <laughs> is this reception yes okay so i don't want to be rude to you okay but public right of access brings you to a reception i've come for legitimate business all i want is if you have got any information if you haven't i can go hello there i was just trying to find out if there's anything about the history of rolls royce that i could take away no, nothing at all. Okay, I'm just doing a story on the airfield, you see, and the story about Mitchell and the Spitfire. Sorry, I thought she was. Yeah, so I'm just doing that, so I just wondered if there was anything well, to pick up. Just reported that you were taking photos of bike sheds, car registration. Who's just suggested that bullshit? Do you know what? People really need to know what the camera's focused on and stop making up crap because now what was a really polite interaction is turning it into something quite pathetic. Okay, no, carry on. You've just been asked to leave the site. Just. just been asked to leave the site. That's what I'm saying, just. So now I'm going. Okay. Okay, no need for the attitude. Maybe no, give your heads a shake no, and no, stop no, being no. rude to members of the public that are just trying to get some information about a company. You know, there is nothing wrong with this. 
Learn the law about public right of way and public access. It will do you a good favour because now, when people see this video, you will probably get lots of people down here. Okay. And it will serve you bloody right. Well taken. Well done. Thank you. So, you have a good day. Hello, <laughs> oh, mate. Do you work here? Yeah. Is there any information about the Second World War on the website for those of us? Because I'm, I'm fascinated about Mitchell and the Merlin engine, and I think that sculpture is brilliant because it's obviously a bird, but it's got the Spitfire wings. I've just been in there to ask. I've never come across it. What's your name, mate? In the life. I work in the Rolls building and I'm not technically Rolls. So no, not a problem. I'm not a history buff either, I could say. That's fine. You, you enjoy sorry. your vape and uh, <laughs> I'll leave you to it, no worries. I don't suppose you guys know if there's any information on your website about the Merlin engine in World oh, War II. Saying, unfortunately, no, no worries, guys. Sorry. That's alright, don't worry. Never apologise. <laughs> so there we are, guys, Rolls Royce. Probably the company's fantastic. The security. What a bunch of wankers. Excuse my French, you know me, I don't normally speak like that. But with an attitude like that, they deserve mass cameras. So if there's anybody within the southwest of England or willing to travel and you want to meet up and come back down and do a mass audit, get in touch. The email is actually on the community part of the page and uh, yeah absolutely rude and I do apologize for swearing I it's most unlike me it's been a good day so far and the attitude the ignorance from security surrounding public filming and public accessible areas is absolutely disgusting and these security firms need to pull their finger out, check the law, stop being little Hitlers and start giving people with a camera a little bit of respect. Would have been different if I'd have been on land where I wasn't meant to go and accusations of private number plate crap and bike sheds. I mean Christ, a bike shed? Is that a security risk? Frickin' hell, the world we're living in. Anyway, enough ranting. Expose and educate. Uh, click like, click share. Give us some comments, guys. Am I overreacting? Um, well, you set me up well for my next location. So I'll drop this one here. Take care, stay safe.